Hey guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to do this colorful reverse stamp autumn nail design. So I'm going to use this yellow by Sinful Colors called Yellow Yellow. Orange by Pure Ice called Gorgeous. This red by Color Club called Frostbite. And green by Creative Play called Cut to the Chase. So I'm going to use the Born Pretty BPL 026 nail plate. It has a bunch of different leaf designs, but I thought this would be a perfect design for a reverse stamp um, look. I always say, if you watch some of my other reverse stamp designs, I always say that I like to make sure that I have designs that have enough space to add colors into it. Smaller um, lines, you know, smaller designs, more intricate ones take a longer time to do, and I want to do something quick and easy. So that's why I always try to find a design that's really big and has enough space for me to color inside of it. Also, I wanted to do autumn it is autumn time and I want to do an autumn design I just thought that just adding this stamp design on its own would kind of be blah and I have to say once I was done I just love the finished look I loved how it popped on top of my gold nail polish which I didn't say I put a base of gold I just thought I always think that gold and autumn go so well together because the colors work really well together I just like that that's my personal thing now I see that other um, you know nail people do um, the reverse stamping with nail dotters you can do that if you want but I like to use a nail brush I get more paint on it and especially with a pointy brush like this one I can get into the very end of the design without messing it up take your time doing this and you can use any colors you want I just want to use these for autumn now once I was done, I applied the design on my nails really hard. I made sure that it stuck on my nails and then slowly removed the stamp. Because if you remove it too fast, you'll ruin your design. And once I was done, I removed the liquid latex, I cleaned around my nails, and I applied a quick dry top coat. I hope I made this video really easy and simple for you to recreate. And here's the finished look. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to get updates on when I upload new videos. And check out my Instagram at Foam of My Nails to see more of my nail art. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.